the Westerhof mill. It's a small mill. The picketing starts. She leads the pickets. Why? How does a 17-year-old girl get to lead? I don't know that part. I never got to meet her. I did meet them. I did meet her son. She's arrested because she refuses to tell the pickets to stop picketing. It's the first of five arrests during the strike. Flynn and she become buddies. Flynn's like a mentor, like a big sister. One time, Hannah Silverman's in jail, and Flynn's here speaking, and she said, you know, they have good speakers in Patterson, too. They got Hannah Silverman running jail speaking to them. There was concern because Hannah Silverman was supposed to lead the Great March up Fifth Avenue in New York to the Madison Square Garden of that time. That's what it was called, but it's not the same building as now. For the Patterson pageant, which we'll see glimpse in here. And it was a concern that she wouldn't be able to do it because she was in jail for yet another arrest. She was sitting at the back of the courtroom and the judge, who was called a recorder, Recorder Carroll, stuck somebody with a really harsh sentence. And she either went, <gasps> or, <laughs> I can't stiff her. <laughs> but he stuck her back in jail. But they bailed her out in time to lead the parade to Madison Square Garden. So that's who Hannah Silverman is. She became an orator on her own with the help of Elizabeth Gurley Flynn and her natural talent and gumption. So that's great. 